No. What many? Iti Abhidhyanitam All that was spoken Raja Raja Nishamya These are the qualifications of Vaishnava. Uh, as you know, there are twenty-six qualifications mentioned in the Chaitanya Charitamrita, and one of the qualifications is Kobi, poet. Every Vaishnava in our disciplic succession, all the Vaishnavas, uh, in the later ages, within two hundred years, uh, during Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's time, there were uh, Bindamanda Thakur, Vaishnava, Lochanda Thakur, uh, Kobi Karanapur. Uh, they are all big poets. Later on, Vidyapati, Chandidas. Uh, no, Chandida is before Lord Chaitanya. Jayadev, he also before Lord Chaitanya. All big, big kavis. The Jayadev kavis, there's pralaya paya dijali dhitabhana sibhidam. So, a Vaishnava, devotee of the Lord, uh, is expected to have all good qualities. Mm. The more you become advanced in Krishna consciousness, all the good qualities that were covered by the cloud of Maya will come out. Good qualities are already there. Mm. Just like Krishna uh, has got sixty-four good qualities in full and we are minute particles of Krishna. Therefore, we have got also those good qualities in minute particles. But these good qualities are now covered. Just like fire is covered by the ashes. So it, it does not act. Although there is fire, but when it is covered by ashes, it does not act. Hmm. So we are fire. Krishna is fire, we are also fire in quality. There's a, there's a big fire, blazing fire, and the sparks. The sparks are also fire. Hmm. Uh, therefore, we sometimes uh, desire to imitate Krishna, uh, because we have got these qualities in minute quantity. So we think that I am God, uh, I become. But we do not know the, the quantitative difference. Uh, that we forget. Uh, we can say we are God, but teeny God, uh, not the Supreme God. Uh, 
spark, fire, blazing fire and spark. Now this quality, fire, this also becomes almost unseen when we are in this material world. Just like if the fire sparks fall down out of the blazing fire, it becomes extinguished. So in order to ignite again our fire equality, we must uh, go back to the original fire. Then the fire equality, the brilliant fire equality will again be exhibited. This is Krishna consciousness moment. So when we are in the process of going back to home, back to Godhead, uh, out of so many qualities, uh, twenty-six quality becomes very, um, at least they become manifest. And out of the twenty-six qualities, one quality is to become a poet. Poet he is. Nobody can become poet unless he is poet. So Kavi and Rishi, Rishi, Muni Rishi, those who are philosophers, learned scholars, they are called Muni Rishi. <coughs> so, read the purport. A pure devotee of the Lord automatically develops all godly qualities, and some of the prominent features of those qualities are as follows. He is kind, peaceful, truthful, equable, faultless, magnanimous, mild, clean, non-possessive, a well-wisher to all, satisfied, surrendered to Krishna, without hankering, simple, fixed, self-controlled, a balanced eater, sane, mannerly, prideless, grave, sympathetic, friendly, poetic, expert, and silent. Out of these twenty-six so, with the advancement of our spiritual consciousness, Krishna consciousness, we should verify whether these qualities are be- becoming manifest in my person. Just like when you eat, you understand that you are getting strength or your appetite is being satisfied. Nobody, you can, nobody requires to ask certificate. You can understand yourself. Bhakti parasanu bhava virakti annatrasya If we are advancing in Krishna consciousness, the our detachment from material things will, uh, attachment for material things will decrease. This is one sign. Virakti on uh, Just like our students, they have become averse to so many things. You are all young boys and girls. Uh, so many young boys and girls are going to restaurant to cinema and so many other things. But you have become detached. You have no more attraction. So one side, uh, progress of bhakti means one side we shall be detached and another side we shall increase or attached. So these are the qualifications. The first qualification is kind. Just like these sannyasis uh, or uh, Rupanuga Goswami, uh, he has got a, a nice child, wife, nice wife, but uh, being kind to the humanity is accepted sannyas. This is kindness. No homely comfort. Uh, this is kindness. 
లోకానాం హితకారిణ తత్వాతూర్ణమశేషమండలపతి శని సదా తూచ్యం భుక్తా దీన గణేశకౌ కరుణయా కోపీ న కంథాసితో రూపగోస్వామి సనాతన గోస్వామి దే ఆర్ మినిస్టర్స్ మినిస్టర్స్ నాట్ ఆర్డినరీ మ్యాన్ అండ్ దే ఆర్ ఫార్ దర్ అసోసియేషన్ వాజ్ మోస్ట్ అరిస్టోక్రేటి మండలపతి శని మండలపతి బిగ్ బిగ్ మ్యాన్ హు హ్యావ్ గాట్ మెనీ ఫాలోవర్స్ leaders of the society so he gave up that association to chava what is this now uh, gave up proposition tatva tu namase samandala pati saning sada tuchcha tuchcha mean may in insignificant what is this? then what they be what he began bhuktya dina kane sako karunaya కోపీన కంథాసితో యు హ్యావ్ సీన్ రూపకోస్వామి పిక్చర్ ఓన్లీ లిటిల్ క్లాత్ కంథా కంథా మీన్స్ హ్యాండ్ మేడ్ క్విట్ ఆల్ రిజెక్టెడ్ క్లాత్ దే ఆర్ పుట్ టుగెదర్ అండ్ సీన్ ఇట్ ఈస్ కాల్ కంథా దే యూటిలైజ్ ఇన్ రిజెక్టెడ్ క్లాత్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్ కంథా so this upagoshami sanatan goshami uh, accepted this mendicant life although they are ministers very rich men not only upagoshami all the goshami raghunath das goshami was the only son of his father and uncle and in those days uh, the income was 12 lakhs 1200000 rupees almost king so for being being compassionate with this poor fellow who had uh, forgotten krishna and working simply unnecessarily so hard to get some bread that's all murha uh, so by becoming kind upon them they took this mendicant or they were kindness and peaceful Vaishnava is never turbulent, uh, but uh, the de- demons, they create disturbance. Vaishnava is peaceful, uh, peaceful, truthful, truthful. Uh, a Vaishnava knows the ultimate truth, Krishna, therefore he is truthful. Uh, and equable he has no distinction or here is a man here is an animal the animal has no soul the man is soul they have no such conclusion every living entity has gone as krishna says sarva jooni shu kaun thea so he is kind not only to the human society these philanthropists altruist nationalist this is that is their their partial first of all they are may be kind they are not kind they are all selfish but even though they are kind they are, they are kind to their own men uh, not even outsiders uh, not to the outsiders in your country they will throw away grains but there are so many hungry people why they should not give produce more if you have got land if you have got men but they are not producing they are not engaging they may not be coming hippies and they learn and learn idol without any protection god has given so much land war produce distribute prasada oh, this is kindness oh. but because they are not krishna conscious they cannot be kind oh. faultless you cannot find any all uh, are the devotee faultless mm. mm. magnanimous uh, thinking for all living entities there is no distinction so i am american i shall think for the american 
I am Indian, I shall think for you. No? Magnanimous. And the most magnanimous is Lord Chaitanya. Namo Mahavadanaya Krishna Prima Pradaya. Magnanimous. Giving Krishna Prema, which is very rare. <coughs> Krishna says, Manishanam Sahasri Shukasti Jatati Siddha. It is very difficult to understand what is Krishna. And Lord Chaitanya is distributing Krishna like anything. Therefore, Mahavadar, magnanimous, mild, mild and mean, clean, all as cleanliness, because they have surpassed the stage of brahmanical life. Therefore, must be very clean uh, by taking bath, by washing cloth, by keeping the kitchen very clean. Everything clean, temple, tan mandira marjana di shu, sri vigrahara dhananitanana, singara tan mandira marjana. The temple should be um, I mean, I mean, bright, always clean. Uh, then, uh, non possessing, uh, material. Mystic person, they are trying to possess more, more, more. A now simply what is absolutely necessary must have. Uh, just like we don't keep any uh, furniture, you know. What is the use of furniture? We can lie down on the floor. Uh, uh, so many things, materialistic person, they possess. But we try to simplify the matter, plain living. Uh, well is at to all. Well is at. Just like we are advising our all students to save your country. Uh, they are becoming hippies. Uh, it's not, future is very gloom. Try to save them. So Vaishnava will always think like that. How people will be happy? Sarve sukhina bhavantu. Vaishnava desire is not exploitation. Vaishnava desire is that how others will be happy, how they will understand Krishna, how they will get happiness in this life or next life. Uh, this is Vaishnava. <coughs> Satisfied in any condition. Uh, not that I must have all these things, then I will be satisfied. Otherwise I am going from the temple. <laughs> no, no, this is not Vaishnava no qualification. You must live with the devotees, even if you are not satisfied. Uh, any condition you should be satisfied. Because as soon as you leave the company, you become again robes, Again, demon. At least you will be saved if you keep with the company and the devotees. Satam prasangat mama vija samvita. If you give up the company, then you will again become rogues and demons. Therefore, you must be satisfied in whatever condition. Whatever Krishna has given, that's all. Satisfied. Surrender to Krishna. And that satisfaction can be achieved only when one is fully surrendered to Krishna. Uh, if I have surrendered to Krishna, Krishna has taken my charge. Krishna says, Ahantaṁ sarva papi, bhamma kvaśyami, then why shall I bother myself? If I am, I am thinking of suffering, it is also Krishna's grace. We should take like that. Even in my consideration, I am in a position which is apparently suffering. We must accept as Krishna's grace. All right, I have surrendered to Krishna. If Krishna is giving me suffering, that's all right. That is surrender. Oh, I have surrendered to Krishna, and now Krishna is giving me suffering. Oh, leave Krishna consciousness. That is not surrender. Surrender means in any condition. He'll remain silent. 
That is surrender. Not that I put my own condition and if you satisfy me, then I surrender. That is business. That is not surrender. Surrender means in any condition, fully surrender to Krishna, without hankering. What is the hankering? Why shall I be hankering? Uh, I know Krishna will give me all protection, otherwise shall I hanker? Hmm. Without hankering. Simple. No duplicity. Simple. Uh, the worldly man, they are duplicity, speaking something, cheetah. Uh, that, is, that is the one of the qualifications of materialistic man. He must be cheetah. Uh, there are four defects. Commit mistake, to be illusion, to become cheater, and imperfect senses. This is called uh, material lie, conditional lie. Uh, we must commit mistake. However, a great philosopher, we are talking about the philosopher, so many contradictory things they say. Because he is an ordinary man, how you can say the right thing? It is not possible. Right thing can be said only by liberated person. Therefore we take advice from the liberated person. Just like we are understanding all this. From Vyasdev, from Sukhdev Goswami, they are liberated. We are not reading some Mr. John and Bill's book, no. Liberated soul. So that, that, that should be our source of knowledge. Mannerly, prideless, grave. Grave means don't talk nonsense. Don't talk nonsense. Don't waste time. If you have got time, chant Hare Krishna. Uh, but don't talk nonsense. Grave, that is called gravity. Hmm. Grave, sympathetic. Uh, well, we should be very much sympathetic if some of our fellow men fall sick. We must uh, take care of him, give help him, because after all we have got this body, sometimes we may fall sick. Hmm? So one, we should be sympathetic and friendly. Everyone friend. As Krishna is friend of everyone. Sridham Sarvabhutanam. So if you are Krishna's representative, how I can be enemy of any, anyone else? I must be friendly. Friendly, poet, an expert, and silent. Silent worker, not advertising. Silent. These are the qualifications and ambitions. So we must try to follow, not imitate, but follow. Uh, follow, that is nice. Uh, then, out of these twenty-six prominent features of a devotee, as described by Krishna Das Kaviraj in his Chaitanya Charitamrita, the qualification of being poetic is especially mentioned herein in relation to Shukadeva Goswami. The presentation of Srimad Bhagavatam by his recitation is the highest poetic contribution. He was a self-realized learned sage. In other words, he was a poet amongst the sages. So. Next verse. <laughs> A touch to shoot Shatam with one. 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 Shoot another Hasibashi tom. Shoot another Hasibashi tom. Shut 
Drubam Satam Shu Sadasi Drubam Satam Shu Sadasi Drubam Satam Shu Sadasi Drubam Shimati Bhakti Ramasha, the stairs of the Lord of